this conflict has killed his soul. This ain't the time to bother me, Rangers. I really ain't in the mood to swap words with you, Rangers. My daughter Jessie should have been home by now. She's been sneaking off with that damn Topekan boy, and I just know he did something stupid and got her captured. Why would you think that had anything to do with me? There's plenty of coffee cans lying around in the world. Don't remember his name. Him and Jesse were friends before that thief Kekaba kicked us out of the Topekan camp. I told Jesse she'd have to make friends with the Atchison kids now, but she's stubborn, like her dad. I, uh, really? We've been fending for ourselves so long I forgot what a kind word sounded like. Do you mean it? Just name your price. I... I... I don't know. I... All right. You win. This war has done nothing but kill children on both sides. I don't know why I couldn't see it until my own daughter was threatened, but... Well... Go tell Kekaba that if he gives me back my daughter, I'm done killing and ready to bargain. Where you'll never find it. Might not be polite, but the sooner you're gone, the better. Dust was gold, these people would be rich. The Topekans have been treating these people like shit.
I always like this little bar. fools would get together and get this thing running again. Nothing would help Arizona more than better trade. Another visit, Rangers? And why would I do that? If I can't use her life as leverage to convince Casey James to surrender, then she will make an excellent example when she is swinging from our front gate. Of course not! Every Atchison we kill hurts me deeply. They... Another visit, Rangers. Why have you returned? Thank you, Rangers. Now we can continue our righteous war with those damned Atchisons unbothered. A small token of gratitude is yours. And why would I do that? If 
I can use her life as leverage to convince Casey James to surrender, then she will make an excellent example when she is swinging from our front gate. What good is honor when you fight a dishonorable enemy? You've seen how Casey James fights, with bombs that kill indiscriminately. The Topekans have lost plenty of innocent girls. Now it is the Atchison's turn. Why are you badgering me like this? An eye demands an eye. A dead Topekan demands a dead Atchison. Casey James knows that. He could stop this any time he wanted, but he just keeps killing. So, if I cannot watch the light go out in his eyes, his daughters will have to do. Maybe then he'll finally stop. Casey James already killed my daughter. I slaughtered 20 of his braves for that. I... I... I see your point. It won't solve anything, will it? But I cannot simply release her. She violated our laws by trespassing on Topekan ground. Very cunning. I don't like others to get involved in our internal affairs, but this would allow me to keep my promise to enforce the law and avoid killing a young woman at the same time. Let us see what Casey James thinks of this act of mercy. I doubt it will lead anywhere, but... Choppers, release the lock on the cell door. Jesse, you're free to go. But do not come back to Topekan territory again until there is peace between our tribes. Thank you. Now, please, let's go. Whoa, these guys are awesome. Just like this tape my mom showed me. Another visit, Rangers? No, huh? Well, it's the ship. Rangers, my heroes! Thanks for saving Ralphie and disarming that bomb. You guys are heroes. Uh, is Ralphie doing okay? I can't. I'm not allowed to go to his house. 
Well, duh. He's a Topekan and I'm an Atchison, which means we're not supposed to hang out together because of something that happened to a train before we were born? Ugh, it's such bullshit. It sucks. No, of course not. Why do grown-ups have to make everything into us and them? Ralphie's a Topekan, so I'm supposed to hate him because I'm an Atchison. I don't hate him. I love him. What's there to like? We're the proud owners of the worst place in the wastes. Even the rail thieves don't want to live here. Why shouldn't I? Look at what the train did. It wrecked and it caused this war. The Atchison's say it's the Topekans' fault. The Topekans say it's the Atchison's fault. I say, they're all assholes. Awesome. <laughs> It'll be a lot easier for me to see Ralphie if I don't have to sneak around their hideouts. See ya. The Rangers, my heroes. The Rangers, my heroes. This conflict has killed his soul and his conscience. Rangers, I just saw my little girl outside. Gave her the biggest hug of her life. I was mad at Kekaba before, but now I'm burning with righteous fury. It's never been clear to me he's gotta die. And that's the only way I see this war ending with any Atchison still alive. Me? I'm not the one who made an innocent girl a prisoner of war. I'm not the one who won't let the Atchisons set foot in a camp that used to be their home. All right. I don't know why I couldn't see it until my own daughter was threatened, but... Well, go tell Kekaba I'm done killing and ready to bargain. Have him meet us at the broken rails and we'll hash this out. We'll bring the brake shoe and fix the rails in exchange for the spike and half the profits from the rail trade. But the spike must return to us. That is not negotiable. We can't both have it. Oh, great, John Henry. How did I not see it before? If Jesse died because of... because I... All right, all right. Go tell Kekaba I'm done killing. I'm ready to bargain. Have him meet us at the broken rails and we'll hash this out. We'll bring the brake shoe and fix the rails in exchange for the spike and half the profits from the rail trade. But the spike must return to us. That is not negotiable. We can't both have it. Where you'll never find it. Might not be polite, but the sooner you're gone, the better. The Rangers, my heroes!
Another visit, Rangers. Why have you returned? Did I not tell you to stay out of our affairs? Well, what's done is done. What exactly are his terms? These are the same demands he has always made. What's in it for me? He gets everything he wants, and I still have one arm and can't drive my train. Give me one good reason why I should change my mind when he has not changed his. It is true. Ending our feud with the Atchisons would allow us to trade again. But why should those murderers share in the profits after all they've done? I want an end to this war as badly as Casey James does, but it seems all the sacrifice is on our side. I am not prepared to make peace unless he gives up something too. You think reminding me of the wreck the Atchison's caused? The wreck that cost me my arm will make me change my mind? I should kill you for this insult. I... But... But no. You are right. We Topekans have learned a sad truth in this war. We cannot ride the rails alone. We need the Atchison's just as they need us of the debt and blood. I don't see how Casey James can ever spill enough to repay it. I'm afraid I... Huh? No. Wait. I know what to do. All right, Rangers. Go to Casey at the entrance to the Atchison camp and tell him this. If, in addition to returning the brake shoe and repairing the rails, he is willing to lose his left arm, then I am willing to give the Atchison's half our profits and welcome them back into our camp. But the Golden Spike stays with us. That is not negotiable. We can't both have it. I will be there shortly with the Golden Spike, ready to deal. But if this is some kind of trick, I'll pound that spike through his heart. Choppers, bring me the Golden Spike. Go, Rangers, and may you speak with silver tongues.
All right, we're here. What does Kegaba have to say for himself? deserve worse than that. But we won't give up the Golden Spike. Our heritage isn't negotiable. We can't both have it. You tell Kekaba what I said. Stubborn fool wouldn't bend. Well, we can't both have the spike. Don't blame yourself. Blame that terrorist, Casey James. Now step aside, Rangers. It's time to finish this once and for all. Choppers, we are victorious. The Atchison Blake has been scoured. We return home to...
see what's happening. Copy Echo One. Echo One, I'm happy to say several members of your team have earned field promotion. Congratulations, Echo One. 